That appears to be our contact. Fuck me sideways. Yes, it certainly doesn't look like his best day, does it? Analyze the clues in the AR workspace to find out what happened to him. This is a non-lethal weapon, so odds are he's still alive, though he may not want to be. They've taken our SIRS contact away, but they may still be nearby. I can reconstruct the vehicle's path from unsecured CCTV recordings. That should allow you to follow it. Construction's nearly finished, and so's our contact if you don't hurry. like our contact's assailants stopped here, but I can't see them nearby. Let's analyze the data to see if we can find out where they went. Contact's assailants are switching vehicles to elude pursuers, which is standard operating procedure for private military perks like Albion. The mercenaries? Shouldn't they be sirs? What can I tell you? They're mercenaries. If you keep looking, you might find out why they're interested in an SIRS whistleblower. I've completed a thorough analysis of the vehicle and concluded it is a van. Don't be a dick, Bagley. What else? Well, I could also mention that the minute traces of sand in the tire tracks indicate that it's been on a construction site recently. But you know me, hate to sound like a smart ass. Where did you go off to? I've been scanning nearby construction yards for Albion activity and, long story short, some dozy git has forgotten to turn off the security camera in the makeshift torture room. Put it on the screen. Oh. I'm not who you think I am. You're Malik, a SERS officer and a leaky fucking twat! Oh. 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 That's, that's not me, I swear to God, please, please! Well, that seems fine, but maybe we should go and check on them anyway. Bagley, can you give me a map thingy?
check back with the others. Arrested. Rubbish. Ah, give it up.
cool, it's cool, calm. I'm dead sec. You called us. Of course. You shouldn't have come here. Now they'll know for sure I've betrayed them. We just saved you. No, you've just damned us both. Look, I'll upload the intelligence onto an anonymous FTP. It'll explain everything. Nah, you're gonna explain it first. My name is Richard Malik. I'm an intelligence analyst. I believe Zero Day are rogue SIRS officers who framed you for the bombings to seize power. Now they're murdering or blackmailing anyone who threatens them, which now somehow includes me. Okay. We'll see what Bagley says about the intel. Just don't make me regret this man. That I can't promise. Malik has made his way out, and now I suggest you do the same. <sighs> okay, I guess that was pretty cool. Can we look at the stuff he sent us? Please. All right, one second. Bags, see if this checks out. Then get everyone together for a debrief. Hell yes! You see all that? Time to pick up where your teammate left off. I'm sure they'll thank you once they stop eating through a tube. Oh, that shit. I'd like to pay a visit to those responsible. You know, for revenge. There's too much grey area here. I don't like it. We should walk away. I disagree. He needs us. May I present the third option? Just use him. An SRS whistleblower, even one you don't trust, could still help us find the arseholes that blew up half of London and framed DedSec for it. You don't have to invite him to your birthday, just use him. Solid plan. Target is gone. DedSec, I got a call about a possible kidnapping. I'll send you the caller's info. Sounded like it was connected to something big. We have a real chance to seek justice here. All right, we'll look into it. What are you doing? I'll be honest with you. I wanted to kill every last one of you over what happened at Bloom, for real. But I could use a hand tracking down Sky Larson's neural map nightmares, so I thought, hey, here's a chance for DedSec to make things right again. Go on. I just clocked a hit and run by a black cab. Happened a while ago, but the news ain't picking up on it. Sorry, am I supposed to care? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because all of London's black cabs are driverless, run by AI. So we're willingly working with police now. For some reason, I thought we'd better judgment than that. I get it. Really, I do. But Lau's not your typical dumb cop. Give her a chance. You really think there's such a thing as an atypical police officer? Ha! <laughs> hey, at least she's not Albion. Give her a chance. She might surprise you. The way you're trusting her? I hope it's not you who ends up surprised. Hello. How are you doing? Do you think Sky Larson is still alive? What do you mean? Alive in the computer, I mean. 
Is it still her? Or is it just a program? Doesn't matter. Regardless of how you define alive, her consciousness still exists. Hmm. I mean, we treat Bagley like he's a living person, do we not? An AI might not have the full capacity of a human mind, but it's got some. Yeah, I think you may be right. It's just philosophy. I'm here. Are you ready to begin? Here's the gist. Malik's intelligence checks out. A rogue faction of SRS officers framed DedSec for the bombings to consolidate power over the government. But now they've noticed that some people are standing up to the new order, and they're blaming you. I believe these are the people you call Zero Day. I don't know their names, but it's safe to assume they have a ringleader. And in my experience overseas, removing the leader... All right, we get it. Take down the leader, we take down Zero Day. But why now? Two weeks ago, a shell company connected with Zero Day's operations imported 40 kilos of Semtex from an old Soviet bloc depot. But it never left London. Which means Zero Day is planning a bombing that will make those earlier bombings look like a bonfire. And I think I know why. As we're all now painfully aware, false flag attacks are a common propaganda tool for despots. Kill a load of people and the rest fall into line behind whoever says they won't let it happen again. In this case, Zero Day. Which means we both want to discover who's pulling Zero Day strings and stop them. We need to get hold of the personnel dossiers of anyone connected with the earlier bombings and their cover-up. Then Malik and I can analyze their common connections and work out who's in charge of Zero Day. And I'll be on the comm to observe. So if Malik's right, Zero Day are some kind of shadowy cabal of spies who blew up half the set pissed off that someone's standing up to them, so they're going to do it again. friends just been taken into Albion custody. So long as you don't cock up that badly, you'll be my favourite operative today. Could've told you that was gonna... Happen? No. Let's actually get some work done. appear to be someone interested in helping London. Funny. I was about to say the same thing. I'm looking for someone who can get to difficult places. Is that you? That depends on what you mean by difficult to reach. Why? Got a set of coordinates for you. I'll tell you more when you recover the files there, right? Speak to no one. He's rude. I, for one, am intrigued by his mysterious aura. And I know literally everything, so that's saying something. I'll pass along the coordinates if you'd like to take on his request.
What do we have, Bagley? More GPS coordinates. Seems we're on a bit of a scavenger hunt. I put the odds at about even we find a corpse at some point. Interesting. Send the coordinates to my optic. you are. I've been expecting you. You're with DedSec, yeah? I've had my eyes on you lot, and I like what I see. Was it imperative for us to have this conversation on the roof? Not everything comes as advertised, innit? I had to check you out myself, make sure you're the real deal. And? As we're Our resistance is only as good as the people in it. We're happy to have you. Bang in. Hype to expose the bastards in charge, yeah? Great. I gotta get out of here. 